What's going on guys? Today we have an Air Force One Premium. Now this one's a little bit different. This one <laughs> is definitely a gimmick. I'm not sure what's going on here. They are detachable uh, keychains. And I'm guessing that's mostly for like hiking and shit like that. And that's attached to loops that are stitched on around this uh, the main swoosh on the sneakers themselves. You can remove this as I mentioned earlier. And you can wear these sneakers as it is. But then again, the, the loops are visible. You gotta bear that in mind. And you cannot remove them or... I mean, you, you could cut them out. But I don't know if that's gonna be any better. But I mean, uh, mostly the, the sneakers are just black and white, but then you got this uh, bronze accents here and there. The swoosh also acts as a bottle opener. Uh, you got the swoosh, the swoosh is black, the, the back tab is black, uh, and the tongue is black. Now the tongue is, is another one of those um, main features about this particular release because it has a zipped pouch. Now it, it is not a small pouch. It's, it's not like a, you know, you can fit one penny in there or, you know, it, it's not small by any means, okay? You need to understand that. It is, it is quite roomy in there and I'm, I'm sure you guys can imagine all these sorts of things that you can store in it. I don't want to give anything away, but I'm telling you, it's going to be a drug dealer's go-to sneaker. Now, I wouldn't think it's um, smell proof as well, so keep that in mind if you want to store something in there that's going to smell. Now, as you can see, I've put a little paper in there. Uh, the paper itself is as big as the swoosh on the side. It just fits in perfectly. It still has room inside, believe it or not. Uh, not lengthwise, but widthwise. You can still fit a little white items in there and you'll be perfectly fine. Just zip it up and you're ready to go. I mean, the zip is not the best. Uh, I'll tell you that now. It is a bit flimsy. So just be careful about that. The swoosh is detachable, um, as I said earlier. And you do that by going around the, the loops, like so. And voila. Now here's a detachable swoosh. It, it holds a maximum of uh, one kilogram. So you gotta bear that in mind. Now here's the, the sneaker without the metal swoosh. I'm not sure how I feel about these ones with and without. Now putting them back is a little bit more difficult for some reason, I'm not sure why. Maybe it's the first time trying this. Um, here it is, put back all together. But yeah, so, I mean, that's it. Let's carry on with the on feet, shall we? I Now on feet, these are fantastic sneakers like any other Air Force ones very comfortable very stylish and I, I have judged these before earlier but i'm starting to like them as i'm putting them on my feet um i think they do look actually quite nice with or without the, the metal swoosh the red on the tongue also just pops i don't know why i mean it looks brilliant in my opinion um you got the bronze the red the black the white I think these are colors that definitely go well together. And then you got this little touch of green on uh, the loops, uh, which also just pops, you know, it's visible, it's there. You can see it and it, everything just, I really, really like this. And this is definitely one I'm going to keep and I'm going to start wearing them. I had just haven't decided it if I'm gonna wear them with or without the metal swoosh. That's gonna be a tough decision. But yeah, I mean, that definitely, definitely, definitely recommend them. I am, um, I'm liking them, man. I mean, I really do like it. Now onto the crease test. This is gonna be painful for me because it is one I'm gonna keep myself. And, but I have to, I mean, this is what we set to do. This is what we will be doing.
Now watching this back, it is definitely painful. And but I'm curious, you know, I really want to see what happens to these. But I'm sure you guys want to find out as well, you know, there's a brand new pair uh, just out of the box, as you saw earlier. And for now, it seems to be holding up quite well. So upon close inspection, I can definitely tell you there are some creases, um, especially on the top of the, the toe box and on the sides, but that's okay. But hey, it is an Air Force One. <laughs> They're not going to hold up forever, no matter how you walk in them, no matter how you treat them. And what the fuck is this? Quality control, man. This looks like a... A shit stain. So yeah guys, that's it. That's it for today. What are your thoughts on these sneakers? Let me know below and I will see you guys on the next one.